When we picture ancient monsters, one word comes to mind dinosaurs. But here's the twist. Some of the most terrifying giants that ever ruled the earth weren't dinosaurs at all. From insects the size of hawks to reptiles longer than buses, nature has produced creatures so massive they make even T-Rex look small. Today, we're counting down seven prehistoric giants that actually dwarf dinosaurs. Stay tuned because number one will shake your view of the ocean forever. The first giant on our list is Meganeura, the dragonfly from a nightmare. Living more than 300 million years ago during the Carboniferous period, this insect had a wingspan nearly 30 inches wide, the size of a modern hawk. Imagine sitting near a swamp and hearing the buzz of a dragonfly. Only this one was as big as your arm, blotting out the sunlight overhead. Articles explain that Meganeura thrived in an atmosphere rich in oxygen, about 35% compared to today's 21%. That surplus allowed allowed insects to grow far beyond their modern limits. Fossilized wings discovered in France reveal not just their size, but their deadly design. Razor thin and built for speed. Many stories describe Meganeura as an apex predator of the skies, hunting other insects, amphibians, and even small reptiles. Videos and museum reconstructions show it swooping down like a jet, snatching prey in its spiny legs, and devouring it mid-flight. Long before birds ever existed, Meganeura dominated the air, reminding us that flight has always belonged to killers. Moving on, we find ourselves face to face with Arthropleura, a millipede the size of a car. Stretching over eight feet long, this colossal arthropod crawled through prehistoric forests 300 million years ago. Imagine walking in the jungle and seeing not one, but hundreds of legs undulating like waves as this armored monster crept across the ground. Fossilized trackways have been found in Europe with one specimen discovered in Northern England so massive it left researchers stunned. Articles describe how the tracks measured nearly three feet across, proof that Arthropleura was one of the largest invertebrates to ever exist. Though it likely ate plants and decaying vegetation, that doesn't make it any less terrifying. Its armored plates made it look like a moving tank, and scientists speculate it could rear up if threatened. Picture lying down in a swamp and suddenly feeling the weight of an eight-foot-long millipede crawling over you. Dinosaurs may rule our imagination, but this crawling nightmare ruled the forest long before they ever appeared. The next giant is infamous, Titanoboa, the largest snake ever discovered. Living about 60 million years ago in the tropical swamps of South America, Titanoboa stretched more than 40 feet long and weighed over a ton. That's longer than a school bus and heavier than a small car. Its fossils, unearthed in Colombian coal mines, shocked scientists when first described in 2009. Articles explain that Titanoboa thrived in the intense heat of the Paleocene, an environment so hot and humid, it allowed reptiles to grow to monstrous sizes. With a body thicker than an oil drum, Titanoboa could constrict prey with a force estimated to exceed today's largest anacondas by several times. Scientists believe it preyed on crocodiles, turtles, and massive fish. Reconstructions show it coiling around crocodilian ancestors, crushing bones before swallowing them whole. Many documentaries and videos dramatize Titanoboa ambushing its victims in murky swamps, showing just how terrifying this serpent truly was. Compared to Titanoboa, even the dinosaurs would have been wise to stay away from the water. Next up is Jacolopterus, the giant sea scorpion that prowled Earth's waters over 400 million years ago. At more than 8 feet long, it was bigger than most humans, and it had claws longer than your arm. Articles detail how its fossils were first discovered in Germany, revealing an arthropod unlike anything alive today. With armor-plated body segments, serrated limbs, and massive pincers, Jacolopterus looked like something from a horror film. Scientists believe it was a top predator, hunting armored fish and smaller sea creatures with ruthless efficiency. Imagine wading into shallow water, only to see a shadow rise beneath you. An armored scorpion lunging forward, claws snapping shut with bone-crushing force. While dinosaurs would rule millions of years later, J. Calopterus reminds us that prehistoric seas were already filled with monsters, long before them. Now we come to Dinosuchus, the terror of the late Cretaceous. 
Its name literally means terrible crocodile, and for good reason. Growing up to 35 feet long and weighing over 8 tons, Dinosuchus was one of the most powerful predators to ever exist. Articles explain that it lived along rivers and coastlines in North America about 80 million years ago. Its jaws were filled with massive teeth built for crushing bone. Some estimates suggest its bite force could surpass even that of Tyrannosaurus rex. Fossil evidence shows that Dinosuchus preyed on dinosaurs, dragging them into the water and tearing them apart. Imagine a duck-billed dinosaur stopping at the river's edge for a drink. Suddenly, the water explodes. An enormous crocodilian jaw clamps down, pulling it under in seconds. In the water, dinosaurs had no chance. Dinosuchus was king. The next giant is a ruler of the skies, Quetzalcoatlus, the largest flying animal of all time. With a wingspan close to 40 feet, it was the size of a small airplane. Articles describe how it stalked the skies of late Cretaceous North America, gliding silently over plains and rivers. But this giant didn't only fly. Fossil evidence suggests it also walked the ground like a stork, using its massive beak to snatch up prey. Some scientists believe it could swallow small dinosaurs whole. Imagine looking up and seeing a shadow stretch across your entire village. That was Quetzalcoatlus, a sky titan that ruled above while dinosaurs ruled below. Compared to it, today's largest birds are nothing more than sparrows. And finally, the number one giant, Megalodon, the most terrifying shark to ever swim the oceans. Living between 23 and 3 million years ago, Megalodon grew up to 60 feet long, twice the size of today's great white shark. Its teeth, some over 7 inches long, have been discovered all over the world. Articles describe how it hunted whales, dolphins, and even other sharks, biting them in half with jaws that could crush a car. Imagine being in the ocean and seeing a fin taller than you are cutting through the waves. Many stories and even viral videos speculate that Megalodon could still be alive, lurking in unexplored depths. Scientists disagree, but the legend of this apex predator endures. Dinosaurs may have dominated the land, but in the oceans, nothing could rival Megalodon. Dinosaurs may dominate our imagination, but they weren't the only giants to roam the Earth. From dragonflies the size of hawks, to millipedes as long as cars, to sharks that swallowed whales, prehistoric life was filled with monsters that dwarfed even the dinosaurs. So which of these ancient giants shocked you the most? Tell us in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe, because next time we'll uncover even more creatures that defy imagination.